time for 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Day Season 5 viewers to catch up on news about the 90 Day Fiancé spin-offs cast members from the past week. It took just one episode for Usman Umar, aka Soja Boy and Kim Menzies, to go from becoming boyfriend and girlfriend to exes. Usman told Kim about his ex Sara, and she now feels like everything is a lie. Mahogany Roca who's been successfully telling Ben Rathbun one lie after another in Peru, revealed that she still kept him in the friend zone and that he was never her real boyfriend. Gino Palat Solo, who's all set to propose to Jasmine Pineda with a week left in his Panama trip, met with her disapproving mother Cecilia before getting engaged. Gino and Jasmine's bond is getting stronger as they dance and shower together. However, the preview for 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days episode 13 shows that Gino sending Jasmine's nudes to his ex is causing serious issues in their relationship. The sneak peek also revealed that Ella Johnson has cheated on Johnny with a friend. Nonetheless, fans aren't surprised, given how selfish Ella has been and how she wanted an open relationship with Johnny just so she could indulge in unhealthy behavior like this. Trouble has also been brewing between Hamza Monai and Memphis Sandoval's relationship which was magically taken care of by a translator called Hamadi. Hamza eventually understood Memphis's views on co-parenting with her ex-husband and proposed to her once again with a sparkly diamond ring. On the other hand, Jimena Morales is on the verge of having to return her own ring to Mike Burke after he discovered how money-hungry she really is. Jimena is not in love with slobbish and piggish Mike anymore but still asked him, are you ending it with me? With puppy dog eyes at the episode's end. However, more drama has taken place in Mike's real life, which could cut short his career in reality TV. Mike is not having a good time in his relationship with Jimena on 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 days as he continues to nitpick his degenerate habits. Whereas in real life, Mike is dealing with criticism at a much more serious level after several offensive Instagram posts from his old account, via at frauded media, were discovered by Reddit users. These include memes with the N-word and one where he has used a hashtag saying, Obama go back and be president in Kenya in 2013. A different transphobic meme Mike shared in the same year reads, I blew a mean something totally different to a mechanic. Viewers who started slamming TLC for their recent casting choices after the Alina controversy are now wondering if Mike will also be fired, given the nature of his posts. While Lisa Ham, aka baby girl Lisa, is happily married to her new husband in the US, she still seems bitter about her failed marriage to Asman, according to her recent Instagram updates. Lisa claims that Kim and Asman's relationship is fake and that Zara is an imaginary person. Kim recently slammed Lisa during an Instagram live with Usman where she not only proved they're still together but also added, I want people to know that my relationship or anything I do in my life is not a fraud. Kim admitted that she started as Usman's fan, but soon their relationship turned into a friendship and she became Usman's girlfriend on 90 Day Fiancé. I don't roll like that and my son will tell you, my friends will tell you that, she declared, adding, I'm a genuine person okay? That's all I wanna say. Tunisian man Hamza proposed to his American partner Memphis for the second time in the sweetest way possible on episode 12. After having resolved their differences with the help of translator Hamadi, Hamza and Memphis finally looked happy together. However, Memphis's Instagram suggests she and Hamza have split, despite rumors of them reportedly getting married and having a baby. Memphis spoke to a few of her 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days fans via IG comments on a post in which she claims she doesn't care about trolls anymore. A follower wrote to Memphis asking her to watch out for herself and the kids by making smarter decisions. In her reply, Memphis confessed, I wish I really would have made the right decision. Source, frauded media slash Instagram, Kim Menzies slash Instagram, Memphis Sandoval slash Instagram.